one. Hi, CCS. We're here to bring you the daily news. I'm Christian Zint. And I'm Zach Valandra. And since Catherine and Morgan couldn't be here, we're going to sub in. Catherine thinks since it was her birthday, she doesn't have to show up. And uh, Morgan, I think, got lost on the way to school. So, um, we hope you're having a great time back from uh, play week. I hope you all had fun in your classes or during the play. The play was really well. Really impressed with you guys. Um, and just hang in there until spring break. Some exciting news at Calvary this morning. Miss Dane Markley is signing to play softball at Asbury College on Friday. Congratulations, Dane. She also got named for Division Three All-Conference player, and she also won the Division Three Miss Hustle Award. So congrats, Dane. Good job, Dane. Um, sports pictures are this afternoon. Um, make sure you get all your forms in. You're ready for that. And get all nice and you know uniformed up. And um, excited to see you guys play this season. And everyone needs to check the lost and found. Everything has been set out, and we would appreciate it if you could stop by and take a look. Because if you don't, we're going to burn your clothes. Okay. Well, um, as we said before, we hope you enjoyed Play Week. Um, we'll be around taking pictures and whatnot of new news uh, stuff going on. And um, I hope you enjoy your spring break. That's all that we have. Now we'll shoot it over to Peyton for the weather. here at your forecast for today 52 degrees and our temperatures will be falling through the day with some morning storms around and then uh, showers through the afternoon here's your seven day forecast 39 tomorrow and yes a few flurries are possible now don't think this is going to accumulate the ground is too warm considering it was 70 degrees yesterday. So again, a few flurries for Friday. Then your weekend looks nice and sunny but cold, and then we start to warm things up for spring break. So overall, spring break doesn't look too bad. Have a wonderful spring break, and we'll see you back here um, in a couple weeks. Hi, CCS. I'm Christian Zint. And I'm Zach Valandra. And we're here to bring you CCS Sports! Well, um, first off, we uh, start with baseball. Calvary lost 12-2 Monday night to Bracken County. The team overcame a uh, rough first inning. They, uh, Bracken County scored nine on us. It was a good game. Uh, James Faulkner came out and pitched for us, and after the first inning, we um, it was only a 3-2 game. So we're really proud of our baseball team. They're looking really good. 80% of the team is freshmen, so they're building, but they're going to be a great team this year. Congratulations to the Lady Cougars who won their second straight game in Minneapolis, beating Heritage 13-3. Dane Markley had two hits and four RBIs, including a home run, which puts us ahead at which put us ahead at 13-3 in the bottom of the fifth, giving us the win. Good job, girls. Also, um, the Calvary baseball team on Tuesday played Silver Grove. It was uh, raining, it was pouring, but they played a great game. Um, Danny McCorder came from the hospital from uh, Stitches and he played the game. He struck out at least eight players and he did a great job. Uh, I wish we could have had him for the whole game, but they played a great game against Silver Grove. And also, the Calvary Middle School girls soccer team opened up the season 4-1 to one with their victory over Okerman. Uh, the middle School boys soccer team won 9-0 nine to, nine to, nine to on Tuesday against Williamstown. Um, Alec Lockhart scored two, Zach, Mc Zach McNeil scored two, Jonah Lamb scored two. You guys are really good at soccer. Um, Kenton Leffler scored one, Josh Moran scored one, and Colby Ch Chard scored the last goal. They did a great job, and um, I'm excited to see them uh, win state their senior year. Some remaining opportunities we have this week. We have the guys baseball team playing Silver Grove on Tuesday. And we have the intramural basketball makeup date on Wednesday, March 25th. Lord, thank you for this great day you've given us. I uh, pray that we'll have a good day, that we'll be safe, and that we'll finish this fourth quarter out strong, and um, we'll all just get along and just finish it out, Lord, in Jesus' name, amen. Amen. 